begun this program with a vision to create an ecosystem for young entrepreneurs. So we began to go to see sponsors, to try and raise funds. The opportunity exists to get young people to understand they don't have to find jobs, they can create jobs. And that was our message. So we became the private tutor to public education. And we went out and we went to schools that weren't advantaged. Some were dysfunctional, some were under-resourced, and we met with young kids and brought them into the program. 12,000 learners went through the program this year. It starts in the cinemas. It's a wonderful way to teach because utilizing story and actually connecting with the environment and the people that they can understand, we taught them how to be entrepreneurs, how to find a problem, come up with a solution, test their solution, get customer verification and validation, and then to actually scale their businesses. We touched the lives of learners in 500 schools. And quite frankly, all you have to do with these young people is ignite passion and purpose and get them on the right path. Because once they're on the right path, they don't stop. You've seen the kind of caliber of young people that we've produced and we're very proud of them. So, I mean, Liberty, our purpose is improving people's lives by making their financial freedom possible. So we believe in financial inclusion and really what that means is that it starts with the youth. If we don't start in the schooling, um, then our children won't be able to be financially included. So that's what it's one our pro one of our programs that we do is consumer education, financial literacy, basically, and uh, we teach people financial literacy. As we are a financial service provider, um, we decided that this initiative is very important. And if you look at the over indebtedness of South Africans, but not just South Africans, but in the world. So we thought that this is quite an integral part to play in. And especially when it starts with, uh, with, uh, with the learners within school, so that they grow up with the mindset of uh, managing their finances properly. So that when they're working or when they're entrepreneurs in the future, they'll be able to manage their money and hopefully uh, provide um, ways of growth within the economy. It feels so surreal, like I still can't believe that it actually happened. But all I can say is that based on the determination we showed onto the project and based on the amount of hard work and sweat we were willing to give up, I would say that it was worth it because it was a really nice experience. It was a really informative experience and we've made a lot of friendships and created created a lot of lot more relationships and it actually it's a learning curve where, where we are solidifying what we want our future to look like and we are paving the way onwards into becoming entrepreneurs that are successful in the economy. The name of our service is App Us Jobs. It is an app that helps young people to find jobs during school holidays. Um, what makes our app unique and different is that it provides our users with a financial literacy program that teaches our youth to be financially literate. And this is a skill that they're not just going to use it for now, but they're going to use it for, life, for, for the rest of their lives because it's a skill that they're going to be able to implement it in their future and it's going to help them to be to make informed financial decisions. The other thing is, before placing a candidate to a certain retail store that they're going to be working at, we make sure that they have customer service skills. Now, the company won't have to provide the training for them because we've already done that. The other thing is that our Apple Feather will prevent, um, provide a CV template. Now, when our users are logging in, it becomes easier for them to submit their CV and we get them a job. So about the journey, it was a hard. It was difficult, I won't lie, because the first night of the boot camp we were shattered. We wanted to go home already because they were so hard on us. But to our surprise, that actually worked to our advantage because if it wasn't like that from the start, imagine it being like that in the middle where we thought we could and stuff. But the moment we got there, the first thing they told us, change your name. Now that nearly broke us down. We called yeah. our parents, we want to come back home, this is not <laughs> it. What we thought we're doing, we actually don't know what we're doing. But throughout the boot camp, we learned to take it step by step. We learned a lot of valuable life lessons, not just about our projects, life lessons. This is a lifetime achievement because what we, what we took from the boot camp will help us till we die because wow, it, it, had, it has been amazing. 
the talks, the motivational talks, the uh, the mock pitches, they played a huge role because we improved each, each and every time we pitched. For more stories like these, go to www.social-tv.co.za, subscribe to us on YouTube and follow us on our social mediums.